Hello, welcome to this video. It's Leonard here from DataLearner.com and in today's video tutorial, I'm going to actually share with you my one-minute scalping strategy using just one indicator that gives you between 70 to 80 percent win rate. So that is what I'm going to share with you in this video. And if you are new to this channel, you love videos about making money online, about crypto trade and investing, then consider subscribing. Hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time videos like this are published on this channel so with that being said let's jump right into it now what i'm going to share with you is based on features trading i'm going to carry out a features trade and as you can see this strategy has been implemented already you see a trade that is currently running um the trade is already running currently running in profit as you can see here and um basically this is just what i'm going to share with you and on my buy bid exchange here you see that is equally on the one minute time frame. That is what I'm going to share with you. So to be able to carry out this strategy, you need um, a trading view account. If you don't have one already, link will be in the video description to so sign up for an account. And then you need a buy bid account. You can actually carry out this trade on buy bid or on Binance. These are um, some of the exchanges I recommend when it comes to low fee, where you can trade and get a lot of results. You can trade with Binance or buy bid link will equally be in the video description. To sign up for any of this um, exchange if you don't have an account already so here on my trading view account once i log in we want to go to the indicator tab here and just go ahead and add remember it's just one indicator we are using and um, in this case i just go ahead and search for rsi oscillator so if i just type rsi oscillator here um, So once I type RSI oscillator, you see this Hekenashi RSI oscillator. This is the one we want to use. Make sure when you see this, you go ahead and favorite it so that next time you don't keep looking for it again. This is the oscillator um, that we're going to use. I just go ahead and click on it to add it up to the chart. And once I add it up to the chart, by default, this is how it looks. So if I expand this, this is how it looks. So I'm just going to do some settings to... I'm just going to tweak this to be able to show you how to use that so if i hover over the setting icon here i go ahead and click on the setting icon and uh, on the input tab here i want to make this open smoothing to seven so make sure you increase this to seven and once i increase it to seven you'll see the effect here and then on the style here i want to change this um make sure that i uncheck this rsi histogram so i'll go ahead and uncheck it you see how it has removed the noise from this uh, um, uh, indicator so once i'm done with that i go ahead and click on ok and once you do that basically what i want you to take note of this is how this looks like and so here um the simple explanation to this rsi um, indicator oscillator is that whenever this candlestick moves with the rsi line here and it hits this this is the oversold um column and then this is the overbought column so whenever this um, climbs or you see the green candle touching this red bar here and then it start reversing down and then you see a green um, a red candle you want to go and short the market and then when it goes on this way when it goes on this way and then you see the red candle trading beneath this green bar here it means that it has been overbought so once it's overboard and you see the RSI line reversing back, once you see a green candle, you want to take a, a, a long position in the market. So whenever this, make sure, please take note of this. The only way you can profit from this, whenever these candles are trading in between the center here, you don't need to do anything. But whenever the, the red candles are trading, they must touch this green bar here. Whenever it touches this green bar and it starts reversing back and you see a green candle, you go ahead and you know long the market and whenever the green candle touches the red bar here and it reverses back and start tracing back when you see a red candle you go ahead and short the market that is a simple way you can actually use this um, indicator and be profitable from it so if we compare this to our chart let me minimize this this is what it simply means um, this is what it simply means so what you are going to do remember that we are trading with a one minute time frame you can actually use this with any other time frame with a very a, with a higher time frame if you want but i'm just trading with the one minute time frame and you want to make sure that you add fast when it comes to trading with this so whenever this green candle are trading at this red bar here and then we'll see the red candle when you start retracing back and we'll see a red candle we want to go ahead and short the market and if it continues that way 
we go on, follow it up, follow it up. Whenever we see the green candle trading, the red candle, sorry, the red candle must touch this green column here before you can actually go ahead and long the market. So right now we see this trading at this green column and when it starts reversing and you see a green candle, you go ahead and long the market. When you long the market, you go on like that and whenever this green candle trades on this red bar here and you see a red candle, you know, going down, you go ahead and short the market. That is basically the only um, easy strategy to follow this on the one minute time frame. Now when it comes to taking profit, when it comes to taking profit, you want to, you know, add fast and not be greedy about this. If you want to take profit, all you just need to do, if I come in here, for instance, I just showed you a trade on my uh, buy bid exchange where I carry out a trade, I enter this market because this red candle was trading at this green bar. And then the next candle was green so i entered a trade around this candle here so um, which is too long actually i long the market if i come in here to here and bring my long position to and set it up here this is where i enter this trade so let me bring that i enter that trade at this candle here when it comes to take profit here because it is a one minute time frame we are trading with you don't want to be greedy about this let me just zoom out this um, chart you don't want to be greedy about this so you want to take profit at 0 0.4 so i make sure that i bring my take profit to 0 0.5 sorry um 0 0.5 that is where i take profit and then my stop loss will always be at 0 0.4 so stop loss will always be at 0 0.4 so if i extend this down make sure that your stop loss is always at 0 0.4 0.4 and then take profit will be at 0.5 so if you did this you would have seen that this would have played out for you and it continues that way if i go ahead and you know look for another um, option here where the green candle okay where the red candle so where the red candle was trading somewhere um, around the green bar here if i go ahead and add another let me just bring in the other short position so somewhere here yeah, this red candle was trading at this bar here. If I bring this to here, meaning that when the green candle appeared, it was somewhere around here. So let me bring this close and zoom this out. So the next green candle was here. This is where the green candle appeared. So if I enter this market here, let me just bring this to here. Let's assume we enter the market here. And then I put my stop loss or my take profit at 0.5. And then my stop loss at 0 0.4 this would have equally played that this would have hit our target and would have taken profit here so that is basically what you need to do and if you want to short the market here where the candle was trading the green candle was trading at the red bar here if i go ahead and short this uh, market let me zoom at this So if I short the market somewhere around there where this green candle was trading here or here, if I short this market, I'll go ahead and bring my short position to and let's say where the green candle, the red candle appeared was here. So where the red candle appeared was here. So if we enter this market somewhere around here, this is where the red candle appeared. So we entered here. We entered here. And uh, if I zoom at this, our take profit will be at 0.5. 0 0.5 for the about here yeah. and then the stop loss will be at 0 0.4 so 0 0.4 you see that this trade would have equally played out as well and this would have been in profit as well so majorly what you do here on the one minute time frame using just one indicator is that Whenever this indicator trades, the candlesticks you are seeing here, whenever the red candlesticks are trading, touches this green bar here, and then it starts reversing. When you see a, a green candle, you go ahead and long the market. And then when the green candle are trading um, on top of this um, red bar here, and it starts retracing back, and you see a red candle, you go ahead and short the market. This way, you are sure of making profit in this market and as i've said earlier you should be expecting around you know 70 to 80 percent win rate using just one indicator and in trading features and the platform i use here is bybit see again the trade um, i currently carried out 
this is where I enter the trade as you can see I enter the trade with you see that the chart is similar to the one you are seeing here on um, trading view so the chart at the same thing I enter the market around here and currently this is where this uh, market is trading and I'm making this amount of profit you are seeing right here now to show you what is possible how you can grow a little amount to a very significant amount using this strategy let me go to my calculator and show you how this works on the calculator tab here, I've, I've told you that this um, um, strategy actually gives you on the one minute time frame, it gives you between 80, um, 70 to 80 percent win rate. So if I go ahead, uh, the win rate and put 80 percent here, and let's say we want to carry out 100 trades and we take profit, remember it's always 0 0.5, always 0 0.5, and then our stop loss would be 0 0.4. So go ahead and put 0 0.4, and my leverage I trade between 50x. In above, so I'll go ahead and put 50x here. And the exchange I'm trading with is Bybit. You can do this with Binance. You can do, you know, I recommend Binance and Bybit when it comes to trading features because of the low fees that they actually charge. So if I do this with um, Bybit, you see for limit order you are paying minus 0 0.025, and then for market order you are paying 0 0.075. So if I go ahead and run this strategy, you'll see that if, for instance, my account balance is $1,000, I can grow this $1,000 if I carry out 100 trades, let's say in a month, in two months, or in three months, I can grow this $100,000 um, USDT on my account to about what you are seeing here, this figure that you are seeing here. This is the exact figure. This is about $24,304. This is what you would have grown in your account so, so it is very possible that you can you know have uh, make this amount of money with this simple strategy that I've just showed you. It is just one indicator. You are using just one indicator and just follow the you know trading rules there, and you are sure of making profit from this market. That is basically all I have for you. If you don't have an account with Bybit, I will leave a link in the video description to sign up for one. If you don't have an account with TradingView. I will leave a link in the video description to sign up for an account and you see go ahead and implement this strategy and you'll be sure of making profit daily on the market trading features so you don't really need some um, level of experience that much of experience to do this even a beginner can do this all you just need to do is understand how to use this indicator once again go ahead and write this indicator down it is uh, the hackness rsi oscillator and um, you can add it up to your chart and use it to be making profit on the one minute time frame so that is it for this video and i will see you in the next video if you are new to this channel consider subscribing because more content like this will be coming and i believe you'll be enjoying it so i'll see you guys in the next video